Now let's talk about question 13. Question 13 is also on flywheel. It says that for a certain engine having an average speed of 1200 RPM, a flywheel approximated as a solid disc is required for keeping the fluctuation of speed within 2% of the average speed, the mean speed. The fluctuation of kinetic energy per cycle is 2 kilojoules. What is the least possible mass of the flywheel if it's dia is not to exceed 1 meter? Okay, so you have four options. So the fluctuation of kinetic energy per cycle is given as delta E is equal to I omega square mean into Cs. That is the coefficient of fluctuation. So the value of I is m r square by 2 because it is a disc. Now the dia is given to us as 1. So this becomes m into d square by 8. So I need to calculate m. The question is to find out m. Okay, So you will get 1 by 8 which is 0 0.125 times m. Okay, so you have i in terms of m, 0.125 m. Okay, now the RPM is 1200. Alright, so we can easily find out the omega. So omega, let me say this is omega mean, this is 2 pi into 1200 upon 60. This is cancelled off 20. So 40 pi, 40 pi is 125.67 radians per second. That's omega mean. Cs is 2 percent. So it will be 0 0.02. And the fluctuation is given to us as 2 kilojoules. So delta E would be 2000 joules. Okay, let's put all the values in this expression and get the value for m. So we'll have 2000 is equal to 0 0.125 times m into 125.67 square into 0 0.02. So from this expression, we'll get the value for m as 50.67 kg. Okay, so the nearest value is 51. So I can say that the least possible mass of the flywheel is 51 kg if this configuration is to be maintained. So the answer is option B which is 51 kg. So again a simple application of this formula. I hope you got this. Now let's move on to question number 14.